When you first open the Stella Architect interface window, it will look familiar to you probably in two ways. One is that it looks a little bit like a PowerPoint window with a blank canvas for your presentation and the thumbnail column on the left, but it also looks a little bit like the Stella modeling window. It's got that toolbar across the top with all the items um, from which you can choose to add into your diagram space. Before we start adding things to the interface, I want to uh, come up with an actual layout for my interface so that I don't just start dumping things in the page willy-nilly. So I know I want my interface layout to include three pages. I only have one so far, so to add the next two, I'm going to use the Add button which is the lower left-hand corner of the software, and I'm going to click that twice so I end up with three pages. I'm also going to name the pages, and I'll start out by naming the first page by double-clicking on the page to open the panel. And the interface settings panel um, includes all kinds of settings for your interface pages. And toward the bottom, you can actually name the page that's selected at this time and I want this page to be called Splash, as this will be the first page that people see when they come to the simulation. And the second page, I'm going to call Intro, um, because this is where I'll, I will include introductory information about the simulation. And on the third page, I'm going to call that um, Experiment. And on this page, people will find ways of interacting with the model and running simulations.